Why do we think, as wedding photographers, that people need 20 pictures of them having makeup applied? There's always one thing that I don't, I've never really got my head around, and I don't know why we do it. Um, people that seem to be hell bent on it. In fact, I was, I was scrolling through Facebook as I, as I do, and I tell myself not to do a lot of the time, and I found that's because I follow a lot of other wedding photographers and there was one photographer who uh, shared a series of images from the wedding and there were, I think there were about 15 pictures of the bride having makeup applied and maybe six or seven of the wedding after that. Um, you know, I'm sure everybody's not the same, but I don't know why we're hell bent on having, having taking pictures of people having makeup applied. And I wonder if it's something that people want. It's definitely not something you'd put on the wall and I'm not sure if it's even even right. I mean, think about it. You, you're taking pictures of people when they're not ready, when they're getting ready. Yeah, people will say, well, they take pictures of the, just the finishing touches of the makeup, but there seems to be a, a lot of it. And if you have a, a lot of coverage of somebody, and videographers do it as well, if you have a lot of coverage of somebody getting makeup applied, surely that implies that they are quite ugly or they have really bad skin and they need lots of makeup. So that's part of the story, isn't it? Is the story the bride has really bad skin and she spent three hours getting makeup applied to go to the to the wedding, which takes up you know the other fifty percent of the footage or the coverage? Um, I'm, I'm I'm over exaggerating here, of course, uh, but I've never really understood why. And I've had a few brides recently have said to me, "We don't really want loads of pictures of the getting ready. We don't want I don't want pictures before I've got my makeup fully on," which is which is fair enough, but other people aren't too bothered and maybe they, they see it as part of the wedding photography and they don't question it. I think this is something that we need to do from time to time is question what we're doing and why we're doing it. Now, getting makeup on is 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 part of the wedding day, you know, getting ready is, is, is quite a big part for some people and it's quite good fun. But it's not necessarily sitting there having your face painted, which is the fun bit um, for most people. It's the bit where you just have a, have a bit of glass of champagne with your friends and um, mess about and there's excitement and you can see all the dresses and the flowers going and all that kind of stuff and that's that's the kind of thing that that is enjoyable and that build up and that anticipation for the day and for me that's what I want to photograph um, taking a picture of somebody with a brush against their face is, is pretty much it tells you that they're having makeup applied it doesn't tell you anything else unless they're smiling in which case it will tell you that they're happy um, so that's it, it's just really a picture of somebody's head and you know, we, we need to move away from pictures of people's heads because there are enough pictures of people's heads later on and what you want to focus on really is the storytelling aspect. Um, it's raining even more now, which isn't great because I'm on my way to the wedding ball. Um, so for me, what, you, what I focus on uh, when people have your makeup applied is the scene. So if you have somebody within the scene having makeup applied, great, it tells you the story, it tells you that part of the day. Um, who, who else might be there, what's going on in the room. So maybe just to include dresses hanging up and the mess and all the croissants that are everywhere and that kind of stuff. Uh, it's more of a storytelling image than just a picture of somebody's head with a brush next to it. I will. I'll, I'll take the second exit, just let me finish. Um, but that's pretty much all I want to say about that. Uh, yeah, so really it's just about about questioning what you do, why you do it, why why do we cover these pictures of people having makeup put on so much and just maybe have a think about how you represented the day a little bit. Goodbye.